you. Sitting in the wrong spot. No. V, v, you never learn, do you? Oh, is it chat time? Oh, come on, hit me with those pearls of wisdom. Get this over with. You laugh, but 50 years in purgatory? Enough time for a guy to get his head on straight. Come to some conclusions. Namely, people don't change. Especially not people like Kirk. Think I don't know? Am I lending Kirk cred for a new Kuroshi? Are we going into biz together? No. Of course something stinks. But in this town, you can't just wrinkle your nose and look the other way. You gotta find what's stinking up the joint, and why. Otherwise, you'll step right in it. Came up in these streets, Johnny. I can take care of myself. Sure, hope so, V. Hey, Kirk. Been a while. V? Holy shit! Barely recognize you! I see you haven't changed. Not a single bit. Huh. Well, you know me? I'm old-fashioned like that. Slow and steady wins the race, huh? So come on, sit down. I'll spill you the deets. Start talking. All right, all right. Listen, job's simple. Got a van standing not far from here, brimming with merch worth fat digits. Driving to the border tomorrow, but a lot of things could happen before then. You feel me? Specifics, Kirk. What's in the van? Militech implants. Experimental series. Shit you can't get on the street. Straight out of some lab in Shanghai. And who does it belong to? Jesus, V, who the fuck cares? Once we take it, it's ours. So, can I count on you or not? Sounds too good to be true. Oh, fuck it. It's worth a shot at least. Count me in. Oh, it's true, all right. Anyways, send you the cohorts. See you at the spot. Later. Back off! Ain't your biz here! You heard what Pepe said. Take a fucking walk. June, fuck off! Or I implant my blade in your ribs! Really? I wonder what Mama Wells would say. What she'd do when she sees you two gonks fucking up her joint. I bet she'd whip out her shotgun, blast your heads off. All right, come on, Pedro. Not worth it. Don't work out. Yo, fuck you! Carajo. Fucking punk. So what? What just happened? Landed in a little trouble. Cleaned up now. God damn, sorry. I, I think I've had a little too much. Fuck, what a night. Why? Why'd you help me? Because he would have caught a beating. Or worse. This fucking town, these people? Just here, minding my own business. If it weren't for you, I'd... Here, for your trouble. The rest, uh... Bartender got the rest. Circling him like sharks on the scent of fresh corpo blood. Could have ended badly if you hadn't stepped in, V. Yeah, well, not all heroes wear capes. How about we drink to you, then? On the house. Not this time, but thanks. Don't drink on the clock, huh? I get it. Respect that. Long day? Could say that again. I'm on a double. No break. Working overtime to make an extra buck? Nah, just don't want to go home. Ten years married, you know? Ten years and suddenly I'm not good enough. No, she has to go get some side action. Anyhow, since you brought up money, you wouldn't be looking for a gig, would you be? Pay solid. Run me through it. It's about my wife, Red. Name's Cynthia. She's cheating. I'm sure of it. Only question is, who will? Could let it eat away at me. Or I could get someone like you. 
Ain't no more than an evening's work. You're gonna have to keep tabs on your wife. Follow her around town. Where'd she be now? She works nearby. I'll give you the address. Knowing her, she'll be on a smoke break. Smokes like a goddamn tire fire. Like half this city. Wait. But today, she was wearing a pink jacket. And, uh... She had a blue purse, I think. Colorful. Always like dressing up. Get a woman something nice for her birthday, anniversary. And what do you get in return? Sure she's cheating on you. Let's start with the fact that she always stays late after work. I know she's lying. Called her office one night, she wasn't even there. Size that? Well, we got a kid together, right? Doesn't even look like me. Different hair, different eyes, all of it. Used to be easy to check these things, but with today's tech, there is a way around every test now. Why you want to know who she's with? What's the point? What's the point? What kind of gun question is that? Simple one. Answer it. I want to look him in the eyes. Ask him how it feels fucking some other guy's wife. Breaking up a happy marriage. Okay, fine. I'm in. You're my hero, V. Means a lot to me. C.D. Barr's betrayal of a beguiling woman sounds like something out of a pulpy noir thriller. Pepe was used to listening to his customers' complaints, but now it was he who needed to get something off his chest. It was the same old story, an unfaithful wife in a city where everything was uncertain. Are you about done? I'm trying to focus. I arrived on the scene, looking for the woman in the pink jacket. The woman with a sordid past. Stop right there. Lady in pink, breaker of hearts, framed by a halo of cigarette smoke. I followed her. Dreaming of the day, the narrator put a fucking plug in it. Decided to step on her foot. Don't know why. Guess they don't call me a gumshoe for nothing. Doesn't even make sense.
not serving you a thing. Feed, dog, listen. One in that runner to another. Got a yarn for you. Quick biz, that you Got is. any pro tips you could You're spare? Interested? All right, lay it on me. I was cruising the net, you feel? And I spotted an interesting classified. Wait, let me guess. Performance enhancers? A used Mr. Stud? Cheap? Now, I'm a serious man, V. And serious matters are what, if not all, that concern me. Somebody's selling a book of spells. Edition dating from before the first net crash. Now... You know a thing or two about that, don't you? Like, how much that soft could run you, and earn you. You want me to clep it for you, don't you? Uh-uh. No clepping required. Just buy the damn thing. Reimburse you twofold. Okay, we will do. Yeah, my man. Zipping you the deets on the cellar. And luck be with you all the way. Sounds about right. Price non-negotiable. You'll need to pay in full on pickup. Clear enough. Agreed. Prem, I flipped you the address. Come by your lonesome. Uh, yeah? Spellbook. You got it? I do indeed. Tucked away somewhere safe. You want coordinates? I need to see my money. Damn, this stinks to high hell. But okay. Take care of your word. You won't regret it. Better not, or you will, bigly, giving you my word on that. Just flipped you the coordinates. Mm-hmm. We'll see. Don't call the way to Ensure your family's safety and charter and reinforced walls and lots of internets. Oh, fuck! Save 
Tech XPR. Gotta be like 50 years old. At least that. Had one, you know. Top of the line back in the day. What's good here? Whatever you desire. Got the book? You got my eddies? As I says, V, I am a serious man. Amount is agreed. All yours. Thanks a bunch. Don't mention it. It's money well deserved.
Started to think you wouldn't show. Shouldn't have, to be honest. Why not? Normally only work with fixers. Clients that avoid him tend to be bad news. I just care about my privacy. Everyone wants their privacy. Maybe, but not as much as me. Fuck me. It's you. It's me, Lizzie Wizzy. Sit, please. Let's talk. Okay, so what's this about? I think you can guess. I'm in trouble. Mm-hmm. And what kind? <sighs> Good question. Been a rough year. Creative block. Can't even say the last time I made anything worth listening to. And to make things worse, I fell in love. It's not the worst thing in the world. It is to me. I have something to say. And that, it's a distraction. I need to focus on my art. So, are we talking a man, a woman? Oh shit, these hands. Sometimes it seems like I just brush something and sparks fly. <sighs> anyway, a man. His name's Liam. Liam Northam. Been together a few months, but I think he's cheating on me. Liam Northam. Nah, don't know him. Tell me about him. Forty-ish, sensitive, guy who never wanted for anything. You know the type. Heard they exist. How'd you meet? He's my manager. I know. I know how it sounds. I never meant to. He's not even my type, but... But? Your body can be chrome, but the heart never changes. It wants what it wants. So what's my role here? What do you want? Proof. And then I'll end things. For good. Liam goes to Riot all the time. I think he meets someone there. I want to know who. You'll find out for me? Can count on me. Perfect. Remember, I want specifics. Details. Recordings or pics if you can. Sure. Keep it in mind. Good. Now go.
Carrie, hey. Drop whatever you're doing. Meet me at the marina. Don't make me wait. Say no more. On my way. In for a real treat, V. Uh, Night City Marina, Pier 4. Where you going? Club's closed. We treat your first amendment right seriously. Judy. So, you got a plan? Damn right I do. Where you go? Over to mine tonight. Club's closed. I'm lay the groundwork with Tom and Roxy. They're with us. So Michael will be here too. How'd you manage that? Got something really big. <sighs> Tell you everything tonight. Last thing, what do you like on your pizza? Hunting. A and A, artichokes and avocado flavor, and zucchini for good measure. Cool, fancy. So I'll see you come evening. Of course I'll be there. Hey V, mm. haven't heard of any cyber you look cycle okay. attacks lately. Go I think in. It's time we put an no end to our little around. arrangement. Drop on by sometime. We'll catch up in person.
Hmm. You look okay. Go in. to swipe some scrolls. Should be pretty spicy. Client's feeling generous, too. What do you say? Intel attached. Don't make me back. Wag. Up for a cruise around the bay. Kicking in with old Carrie. Okay, yeah. Sounds promising. I'm in. Music to my fucking ears. Off we go. Now if I can find that button to raise and Dad. Seamarai. All ahead! Okay, so let me hear what this is all about. Like I said... Life's loops. Uh, breakfast cereal? No, 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 no. Loops. Cycles. One chapter ends, another begins. Life's full of them. At least my guru tells me so. I'll bite. Tell me about these loops. Okay. So, first tune I ever wrote that was worth a damn. I wrote it to see. And you notice? Fingers are on to something fresh again today. There's a loop for you. And you need company for that? Not just your company. I needed you, V. Been thinking about that us cracks fiasco lately. About how you helped me. A lot. You shake things up, V. Make me feel... I, I, I mean, before you came along, I was stuck in the mud. Scared of my own shadow, even. And now? Got me thinking about a new song. A new album, even. Real fucking... Thrasher with a new soul. Like everything from now on. 
had what I think folks call an epiphany. Could just be what folks call maturity. You'll see. No more mayhem, no more shady-ass schemes. Done with that. Well, starting tomorrow. Gonna fucking help me? Or just stand there like a gawk? Jesus, Carrie, that, that's Eddie's down the drain. Hit the nail on the head. Think this is my boat? Who's the fuck is it? That head motherfucker, L.B. Kovacek. Kovacek. That Kovacek. Mm -hmm. Never got a chance to talk to me. Thank you. For the us crack shit and a few other things. Do something and smash it. This one's on LP. Okay, let's rip this boat to shreds. Well, well. Finally ready to party. Either he's gone senile or he's finally wising the fuck up. Could be either. 